Welcome to the vlog. This is day five of my Virgin Voyages Valiant Lady cruise vlogs and today we are docked in Puerto Plata. This, I believe, is my very first time here. The port doesn't look very familiar. I'm super excited for today. It's 9.30 and we currently have an excursion booked for 10.30. So we're going to run on up to the galley, grab some food quick, and then we're off the ship. We are doing dune buggies Be and then a beach tour, and then we end up at the beach. Mountains, countryside. Mountains, countryside, yes. Um, if you haven't been watching my other Virgin Voyages vlogs, I am not cruising with my sister. I'm actually cruising with my fiance back there. Um, this is his first time on Virgin Voyages, and I think he is becoming a fan, which is very exciting. I don't usually do excursions unless there's something really exciting that I want to see, but um, thanks to our amazing travel agent, my sister Jillian, she was able to get us over $600 of onboard credit to use. So we figured an excursion is the way to go. So if you're interested in booking a cruise, be sure to check out um, her email in the description below. See how warm it is out there. Oh my goodness. Whew. Ten fourteen meeting point for our excursion is just on the pier at ten fifteen. So we're gonna meet. All the excursions are lined up right in the port. Have to sign our way, wipe away first. Alex just goes to these beaches and asks for the local. <laughs> Currently 2.30 ship time, 3.30 Dominican Republic time, but that was an exactly four hour excursion. Oh, we didn't walk through this on the way out. Looks like a really nice lazy river right off the port. So this is a good option if you don't want to head far from the ship and quite a few shops. This really reminds me of Costa Maya. It's beautiful. It's just all located right off of the ship. Delivery. This is Ship Eats. So we've been back, I don't know, for like 
30 minutes, showered up a bit, got some mud off, and instead of heading up to the galley, we're gonna do Ship Eats. So Ship Eats is room service, and I have found there's like snacks, like trail mix and chocolate covered strawberries, and then there's also um, some meals and appetizers from restaurants on board. So my favorite thing to get is the charcuterie board from Extra Virgin, which is through Ship Eats. So a little bit of advice, there is a delivery fee that will be taken from your sailor loot, but if you were to order anything that costs money, delivery fees actually wave so we love these ginger shots um so we were gonna get them anyway so we got them through here um they're five dollars each and then that waves the delivery fee so these are the meatballs these are from extra virgin i believe this is from the wake alex got that these are the cookies um from razzle dazzle and then the charcuterie like i said and then pop is free on virgin and those are the ginger shots Yum! Okay, one nap later, it was about 40 minutes. I think we're right on track with one nap a day. We've been exhausted, but that's because we're doing so many things, which is okay. If we have a nap, then we can stay up way later. Um, I'm actually on my way to the grounds club to grab us both a coffee. We have about a half an hour till dinner, which is unfortunate that dinner has been so early, but that's the only time I can get dinner, re dinner reservations. So um, I'm going to just enjoy the coffee on the balcony before finally finishing up getting ready. Hi, can I do an Angelino with oat milk and then a um, iced Americano black? Thank you. You're welcome, Rachel. Thank you. This is outfit number five of the cruise. We are going to the wake. I put on a dress. This is from Zara. Alex calls it a shower curtain, but it's not true. that's okay. It's I a like regular curtain. <laughs> okay. Oh, sorry. It's mostly because of the the bangly fucking. Oh, okay. It's a, it's the design of a regular curtain. Sorry, I have a different dress that he calls a shower curtain. Um, we are. <laughs> Five minutes late, but they give you, like I said in the last vlog, they give you about 15 minutes grace period with your reservation. So we are going to run down to the steakhouse on board and get some steak. And of course there is a huge line for reservations. salad again. I am a creature of habit when it comes to these restaurants and I'll switch it up with the clam chowder. Yum yum. Okay, I switched it up. No fillet today. I got the New York strip. This looks amazing. Asparagus, asparagus, mushrooms. Alex also got the same thing as me. <laughs> <laughs> that was your first bite. Piece of lettuce.
have made it back in the room after the wake and then we've just been enjoying some wine that we have in the room here you probably saw me really struggling to open that bottle and then alex had to help um but you are allowed to bring on <laughs> Please ignore that Alex. We've had issues with our door and if your balcony door isn't fully closed Then the air will not go on so we've had some warm nights with no air. So he's trying to get that figured out That's what oh, the noise I is. Not doing it. Oh, he figured it out. Okay no, I didn't figure it out. <laughs> But anyways, you can bring on two bottles of wine um, Per stateroom, so we weren't sure if we had enough bar tab which turns out we will definitely still have enough bar tab But we ended up bringing two bottles of wine on so um your cavern store will give you um, a bottle opener, a wine opener, or it will be just in the room. It is just this, which you can actually purchase for $25. It's pretty, pretty nice. Um, but that's, that's what I was struggling to get the bottle opened with. So we're just enjoying this and I forget what I was going to say. Wine to go. Let's go see if we can spend this on board credit. Yes. Spending Sailor Loot was kind of a success. I spent $20 on this hat. I actually really like the hat. Um, I'm gonna wear it tomorrow and I could not decide between sunglasses and there was a nice ring. Um, but the sunglass person said they she's been out of a lot of sunglasses. Everybody is doing what I'm doing, trying to spend their Sailor Loot, but I will decide tomorrow. Shops are open all day and we're quickly running to the room, top up our wine, get rid of this hat, and we're off to the show. In the red room, you can't have glass, so we now have pints of wine, and now it looks like a lot of wine. A few pints. similar to that um, on the transatlantic but it was a different diva without the extra singer or without the extra dancers and it was just in um, just in the manor so that one was really good that was a nice nice little show now we're off to the circus which is in the manor um, which is with the people from dual reality so I definitely yeah. don't want to miss this and then I believe the manor will turn into the nightclub um, not sure how long we will stay for that, but we're definitely gonna go catch Do Reality. Yet again, it's secured and stolen. Um, usually pizza's been taking quite a bit. One night it was 40 minutes, and tonight I asked how long, because I didn't want to wait 40 minutes. There's the pizza. And they said 15, turns out it was like seven minutes. It, <laughs> the buzzer was uh, vibrating or ringing, and I had no idea, so that was, that was great. We are off to our room, <sighs> out of breath. Because Jill's making me take the stairs, even though she's not here. Um, we will catch up with you in the room when I finally get there and catch my breath. Okay, we are 
back in the room. That, oh, and, oh yes, of course we have to show the pizza. So when we couldn't decide what to get, I wanted to get the, I forget what it's called, but it has truffle and a, an, an egg on it, and Alex wanted to get the special. And we were kind of like, hmm, which one do we get? And the person who was taking our order was like, why don't you just get half and half? So there's a little tip for you. You can get half and half if you can't decide. And I think that was a good choice. I will not be touching that eggplant. Gross. Fun tip, uh, Virgin Voyages actually procures truffles <laughs> from the foothills of Germany. They found in the most exclusive of ways, and although it's expensive, they provide it to you at a low price. So Of free. Low price. Of free. Pizza is free on board. Okay! But, I can't believe it. Night number five is over, although this cruise has felt much longer than five nights. So, Tomorrow it is a sea day. I, oh, a little blurry there. I absolutely love sea days. So I'm ready to sleep in, probably head to the wake for breakfast. Hopefully if we can get a reservation and then just hang out at the pool. So if you would like to see what we get up to on our last and final sea day on Valiant Lady, be sure that you are subscribed and like this video if you enjoyed it. It helps out our channel so much and we will see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching.